<laughs> Talking of people helping yeah. Gordon, who's been parachuted in? Alan Sugar. Mm. Big Al. He's, he has... <laughs> so I don't believe it. What are you telling me? <laughs> <laughs> what? I can't believe it. Um, take two. I can't believe it. <laughs> um... <laughs> He's still in my head, he walks going on. <laughs> so he's walking into number 10 down the street doing the old Alan Sugar bit. But that means he might have to give up The Apprentice, is yeah, that right? Yeah, that's he, all right. He can't work for the BBC <laughs> and the government. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Well, I mean, there is technically a conflict of interest there. Yeah, that's why neither of you work for the government. Yeah. Indeed. Well, I do my bit. Yeah. <laughs> well, you think so. I think that's fair. He was a big noise in agriculture and fisheries. <laughs> <laughs> a big noise. A big noise. <laughs> He's got to stop being Sir Alan, though. Yeah. He's yeah. got to be Lord Alan, just the snow fun. Of where would he be, Lord? Because you get to choose, don't you? Where, where would Alan Sugar choose? North London. Uh, of Tottenham. Le leave it out, land. Do it, my head. What are you thinking about? <laughs> oh, don't get you. <laughs> I've actually seen the show. I've got no idea how he talks. <laughs> He's actually here to now discussing his, his new boss mm -hmm. with some of his colleagues. I think this sell. has been a bloody disaster. <laughs> He's a waste of space as well, right? <laughs> Do you have to make some mess of it? I think Edinburgh isn't what it used to be. You're a total shambles. You're fired.